Since the explosive first test launch of Starship's heavy lift rocket on April 20th, Starbase Boca Chica has been a hub of non-stop activity. The aftermath of the launch resulted in some damage to the launch pad, which has prompted extensive construction work to clear the debris and reinforce the launch apparatus. The pace at which the repairs are being carried out is truly remarkable. While the attention has largely been focused on the damaged launch pad, there is a significant progress being made behind the scenes to propel the Starship design to the next level. Starship enthusiasts and observers have been keenly observing the ongoing work and developments. Additionally, CEO Elon Musk has shared some valuable insights into the future of the Starship platform, providing us with a glimpse of what lies ahead. Alongside Elon Musk's comment, there have been intriguing new images of Starship hardware emerging from Boca Chica. These images offer a fascinating look at the latest advancements in the Starship design. The new hardware hints at potential improvements and modifications that are being implemented to enhance the capabilities of Starship. By discussing the continuous activity of Boca Chica, the progress in repairing the launch pad and the new images of the Starship hardware, we can paint a comprehensive picture of the evolution taking place at the forefront of Starship development. Elon Musk's Comments and Starship's Future Elon Musk's recent comments have shed light on the development of the third variant of the SpaceX Raptor engine. Just two weeks ago, on May 13th, Musk confirmed that the Raptor V3 engine has been test-fired for the first time. The new variant demonstrated significant improvements over the previous Raptor V2 engine with a maximum pressure of 350 bar and a thrust of 269 tons. Musk's acknowledgement of the Raptor V3 engine signifies a crucial milestone in the ongoing evolution of the Starship platform. The improvements and increased thrust of the Raptor V3 engine are a clear indication of SpaceX's ambitions to lift heavier payloads into orbit. With the current configuration, Starship is rated for a payload capacity of 150 tons when fully reusable. However, the stronger Raptor engines will enable a payload capacity of 250 to 300 tons in the expendable mode, which sacrifices the Super Heavy's landing fuel to achieve higher velocity. This represents a significant boost in payload capacity and opened up new possibilities for space missions. The need for stronger engines to lift heavier payloads into orbit is driven by SpaceX's strategic goals. By increasing the payload capacity of Starship, SpaceX aims to expand its capabilities and undertake more ambitious missions. The enhanced thrust provided by the Raptor V3 engine will allow Starship to accommodate an additional 700 to 850 tons of fuel and overall mass. This increase in size and capacity will enable SpaceX to transport larger station parts, heavier scientific hardware, and even specialized Starship variants. Potential Implications and Uses for Increased Payload Capacity The increased payload capacity of Starship has numerous potential applications. With the ability to haul larger station parts, SpaceX can contribute to the construction and expansion of space stations, facilitating further scientific research and exploration. Additionally, the transport of heavier scientific hardware opens up possibilities for more advanced experiments and instruments to be deployed in space. The enhanced capabilities of Starship also offers prospects for specialized variants. For example, fuel-filled versions of Starship could serve as floating gas stations in orbit providing refueling capabilities for other spacecraft. Long-duration habitation modules could also be developed, enabling humans to venture further into the solar system. The implications of increased fuel storage are particularly significant for NASA's Artemis III mission. As the first mission to return humans to the surface of the moon, Artemis III will rely on the spaceship lander. However, with the Lunar Gateway Station not expected to be operational by then, SpaceX will need to transport enough fuel for, to facilitate the entire mission, including rendezvous, landing, and return to orbit. The increased fuel storage capacity made possible by the Raptor V3 engine would provide SpaceX with the necessary resources and flexibility to support the Artemis III mission successfully. By exploring the potential applications and implications of Starship's increased payload capacity, we gain a deeper understanding of the significance of SpaceX's advancements. The ability to transport larger payloads and increased fuel storage opens up new possibilities for space exploration and establishes a foundation for more ambitious missions in the future. Progress at the Starship Factory – Starbase's Evolution The Boca Chica launch site has been a hub of continuous construction and expansion. Since the explosive first test launch of Starship's heavy lift rocket on April 20th, Starbase Boca Chica has been non-stop in activity. The focus has primarily been on repairing the damage caused by the test launch and reinforcing the launch apparatus. The pace of the construction work has been truly incredible, with the goal of quickly progressing the Starship design to the next level. 
Among the various construction projects taking place at Boca Chica, the Star Factory stands out as a significant development. In March 2022, SpaceX broke ground on this new structure, which is designed to replace the current setup of disconnected tents and bay facilities. The Star Factory aims to be a permanent, massive building capable of housing the assembly of numerous super-heavy boosters and Starship vehicles. With a planned size of 300,000 square feet and a ceiling height of about 60 feet, the Star Factory will revolutionize the production and enable the assembly of the world's largest rockets. Recent aerial photography of the Star Factory site reveals the progress being made in its construction. Many of the Phase 1 footings, which are concrete pads sunk into the ground to support the building, are already in place. These footings consist of smaller concrete squares poured around in underground columns that transfer the building's load into the bedrock. Additionally, larger sections of the foundation pad have been poured, indicating that the steel skeleton of the building will soon be assembled. Although the current construction progress represents only a portion of the final structure, it is a promising step forward. SpaceX anticipates clearing older structures from the site to complete the rest of the building in due course. K2 Utilizing Starship's Lift Capabilities K2 is a promising startup company that aims to leverage the enormous lift capabilities of Starship founded by two brothers. K2 plans to develop a system of satellite buses smaller vehicles that can be deployed with satellites and ferry them to their designated destination once in space. This system is reminiscent of Rocket Lab's photon kicker stage, highlighting the potential for efficient payload delivery. Initially, K2's focus will likely be on developing a simple tug equipped with efficient thrusters, enabling it to transport payloads ranging from 1 ton to 15 tons. The tug will also incorporate additional communication equipment to ensure reliable delivery of payloads to their intended locations. By utilizing Starship's lift capabilities, K2 aims to create a flexible and cost-effective solution for launching large satellites and facilitating their deployment in space. K2's system of satellite buses fills a gap in the market for maneuvering larger payloads in space. Current challenges include servicing large telescopes like Hubble and the upcoming James Webb Space Telescope, as well as maneuvering around various station modules from different companies. Starship's increased payload capacity and K2's efficient delivery system offer a potential solution. Additionally, as the industry currently focuses on many satellites and small launch vehicles, K2's strategy of targeting larger payloads aligns with SpaceX's vision of reducing costs and increasing reusability. The progress at the Starship factory and the innovative plans of K2 demonstrates rapid advancements taking place in the aerospace industry. The construction at Boca Chica signifies the evolution of Starbase, when the Star Factory poised to revolutionize production and support the assembly of larger rockets. Meanwhile, K2's utilization of Starship's lift capabilities presents opportunities for more efficient payload delivery, catering to the needs of the market and pushing the boundaries of space exploration.